So as I was perusing down these social media streets, I said, this is enough for me to want to share some sensibility. All right, let's get into it, shall we? So Peter Thomas, coming back to reality TV, are we? So let's take a listen. And it's funny because he had someone join his live and they were both confused about who the other was. But but take a listen and they both handle it nicely and gracefully. Love to see it. No better. Not a, not a celebrity. I'm Peter. Just Peter. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I know I was on that Bravo show for years. Just Peter. I'm about to do another show called Raising the Bar. They make a show of me doing my bar. That's some big shit. I actually put these people on hold for six months because I needed to work out what the fuck I was doing in my life before I start something like that. And I'm supposed to talk to them today to let them know I don't want to do Miami. I want to do Atlanta. You know, and there's a lot going on with me, so I got to let them know all that's going on with me because then it's going to air it out on TV. If I speak to, I spoke to Cynthia this morning, okay? Cynthia and I are friends, not lovers, friends. <laughs> Love of part is in the past. Mm-hmm. What, what about Thirst Bucket here trying to shoot their shot? Oh, wow. Who's, try, who's trying to shoot their shot, baby? Yes, I owe. I, yes, still owe money in Baltimore. Okay. But if you guys know what was going on with me in this IRS situation, then you'll understand why it's being dragged out. Mm-hmm. But I always pay my bills. Always. Better late than never. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What else? Mm. Come on to New York City. I am a New Yorker. <laughs> I am a New Yorker. There's one thing about New York, bro. When I go to Brooklyn, I cannot walk down the street without hearing my name a thousand times. Don't let me go to Flatbush. You know what I'm saying? I'm going flat, but Peter, 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 niggas run up on me like if I'm running for fucking mayor. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> they love me, Flatbush. Mm hmm. I'm going to spill that shit on me. Where y'all at? Hi. Hi. How are you? Too? I'm fine. How are you? I'm good. I'm just kind of getting my day started. How are you? I'm great. Where are you? Where's your day being started at? I'm in Arizona. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. I'm, I'm just mad at to have, you know, group like that. So everybody tell me that I should move to Arizona and the weather out there is better for my type of illness. <laughs> it's very beautiful right now. I can tell you that. We're in Arizona. No, no, are you? I'm in Phoenix. Oh, wow. That's not far from Scottsdale. No, not. Maybe like 20 minutes, I honestly. I love Scottsdale, Arizona. I love Scottsdale, too. I work there. Wow. <laughs> you know, that's, I'm telling you something. If I should move from Atlanta and I want to try somewhere new, mm-hmm. I think I will end up there. That's the only other place outside of Miami that I think I would live. I feel I feel like there's definitely an influx of people who are moving here. So yeah. I think we would love to have you. <laughs> yeah, I would love to be out there. At my age right now, I need to just chill the fuck out. <laughs> well, Get up there. Uh, uh, how old are you now? I'm 62 years old. 62? Yeah. You look great. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate it. I'm an older I'm an older man. I'm in the I'm in the last quarter of my life. <laughs> if I if I live to see, I told my brother yesterday, I said, if I live to see dad age, he died at 83. 
that mean I have 21 more summers and 21 more winters left. God forbid, don't you say that. Yeah, if I live to see my dad's age, you know what I mean? That would be great. Okay. These comments are so mean right now. Oh, so much tomorrow. They can't help them. Yeah, they really can't. They love you. <laughs> they don't. I literally just woke up and they're talking shit about what I look like. Oh my <laughs> God, are they fucking with you like that? I see yo, it. Yo, people, stop it. Yeah. I'm, Y'all y'all are not even brave enough to come on my FaceTime with me. And you want to critique this beautiful woman. Y'all are bugging. <laughs> the pit of the mind is stupid. There's a Thank lot you, of mean people. That. There's a lot of mean people on social media. They I like know. to be mean. They love to be miserable. It's okay, though. So, so you're the real Peter Thomas? There's no other. I <laughs> I mean, I've used your skincare, obviously. I just didn't no, know. No, no, not that guy. No, oh. that guy is Peter Thomas Roth. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm so R -O -T -H sorry. R-O-T-H at the end of his name. <laughs> okay, and he's an old white guy. Oh, okay, I'm I kind of thought so. I'm an old black guy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> not the same Peter Thomas. I'm, I'm in a... Hospitality business. Confused. That's, that's okay. That's all right. What do you do? So, so you only follow me because you thought you, uh, you uh, I'm the skincare guy. You know, actually, I got my own skincare coming out. Check this out. Oh yeah. Did they send me all these samples? Oh my god. They, they won't send me all these samples that they won't really choose from. Okay. Well, you have beautiful. Skin. See, I can tell see you. You, all you, care. you see all of this? I do. All right. Yeah. And it smells great. They want me to say, Peter, which one do you want? What is that? Like a toner? Yeah, this is a major company. You oh, see? Wow. The beard stuff. Okay. I love it. They send me all of these things. Uh, uh, Ingrown air stuff, you know, black men suffer from that. I'm not one of those black men, but most black men suffer from that. Okay. Uh, the face, the face scrub, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah, my whole skincare line coming out. No, oh, I can tell you, can tell you definitely take care of yourself. Yeah. Love it. Well, Love it. right now I'm just using soap and water and it's working. <laughs> But they have the this company say, yo, your skin always looks so great. I think we should do a skincare line with you. I said, come on, let's go. You know what I mean? I mean why not? As long as, what do you do? As most of the stuff is natural. No, all I do is like I, you know, um Ivory Ivory, what is it? Ivory spring soap. I like the, okay. I like the way it smells. Oh, and I, I, don't break, I don't break out I don't break out from it and it doesn't leave my skin too dry. That's good. Or, I, or ivory. Yeah, yeah. What do you do, what Peter? I, I'm sorry. What do you do? I'm sorry for mistaking you for. No, I, I I do restaurants and nightclubs. I used to do restaurants and nightclubs. Um, from the music industry, I worked at so Sony Music. I worked at Def Jam, Universal. Oh, really? For years, yeah, for years. Uh, develop um, uh, uh, music conference. I executive produce TV shows. I did a lot of <laughs> stuff in my life. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Been in that industry for a long time. I love it. I'm I'm sorry. I'm kind of looking at these comments, and they're just really wild. <laughs> somebody, yeah, yeah. Somebody said I'm I'm, I'm reading some of the comments. I don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> oh, somebody said Peter lives in Atlanta. He knows what's up. Make How is Atlanta? Facial kit, Irish Spring soap. <laughs> cream and done. <laughs> Atlanta I, is beautiful. Atlanta to me is like Wakanda. Oh, yeah, you really? saw the movie talk about Wakanda. So like Atlanta, Wakanda. It, 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 I'm gonna be honest with you. Yeah. I could go every day for a month and interact with business people, mm -hmm. interact with city officials, interact with um restaurateurs, customer base, and never speak to one white person. <laughs> okay. And that's, that's why we call it Wakanda. Because so just, there's so many black-owned establishments here. 
Black, I mean, well, that's home, black operated, black uh, attended, um, number one airport in the world. It's the only airport that you can go to, and every vendor is black. Okay, and it's the number one profitable airport in the world. And with traffic and that's money. And that's Atlanta. You can't get that anywhere else, to be honest with you. I mean, I've heard, that, I've, I've heard that Phoenix else. has a good hair. I've heard Phoenix has a good airport. I don't fly they're not, out of it too often. They're not, they're not even on the top 20. Phoenix. I thought they were. No, they're not, baby. Go, go look again. You, you know, you could ask Siri and Google it, anything. <laughs> By the way, I'm, I'm going to say this to you. Last night, uh, my phone is right on the, the nightstand and my Google thing, because I like to hear music. You know, like, mm -hmm. I like to listen to, like, Al Green and, you know, Teddy Pendergrass and music like that before I go to bed. All right, you turn the TV off, listen to some music, play it low, and, you know, go to sleep better that way. All right, and I have my phone on the nightstand and my Google Play on the nightstand. And I said, hey, Siri, because I wanted to get the music, but yeah. Siri does music also. So I said, hey, Siri. And I said, nah, I mean, hey, Google. And Siri got upset. <laughs> I thought it was. She said, wrong, the wrong one. one. That's not my name. I was I like, am not. what the fuck did just happen? <laughs> this thing is responding to me because I, and then Google did the same shit. I'm like, yo, this shit is scary. <laughs> it is scary. That happened to me last night. That shit is scary. Okay. I'm like, wow. They listen to everything you say, by the way. <laughs> so if you address them by not their name, they, mm -hmm. they do not like that. They have have their program to recognize that you just call them something that's not their name. I saw it on Instagram, uh, and I, I thought it was somebody playing, but I think it's real because last night it happened to me. She said, that's not my name. <laughs> she said, wrong one. <laughs> I said, my apologies. And I said, I cussed at Google. And he said that he's not programmed to listen to that kind of language. Okay. Well, Basically, you better get, you better get it together, sir. Yeah. <laughs> like, and then the motherfucker shut down right after that. <laughs> <laughs> I had to start all over with that shit. <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck? You know, I've lived long enough to see that shit. You know, that shit is crazy. Oh, oh but I'm God. sorry I'm the wrong with Peter Thomas. I hope you enjoy our conversation. And I hope you have a beautiful day. Thank you. I'm kind of reading these comments and all of my friends are tapping in and they're like you're so funny oh your fr friends are tapping on on my page yeah i didn't i, I didn't know that dope dope i, I see my friend tasha my friend is my friend Jaden is texting me telling me i'm funny on live right now that somebody <laughs> said somebody said peter e is not a woman what the fuck i am not a woman peter you're a man Yes. Oh my <laughs> God! I did not know that. I'm okay. sorry. You you're beautiful. <laughs> Thank you. I mean, I I try to take care of myself. I just oh, woke you're up doing a good, you're doing a good crazy. job. You're doing Thank a good you. job. You see, I see yep. your hair up like that. Your face is you. You got a pretty face, and I just immediately <laughs> assume that you are a woman and you're not. Oh my God! Okay. Thank you. But that's okay. Uh -huh. All right. So let's start over. How the fuck are you? I am great. I'm, I'm actually just getting my day started. Yeah. I saw your live, so I requested it, and now everyone's what, being. What is it? What is it you do? I'm a makeup artist. Okay, excellent. Okay, yeah. all right. That's why you're into skin skincare thing. Yeah, I'm. I'm not, I mean, I don't look the best right now because okay. I, I just woke up. And, wh and where are you from? I know you live in Arizona, but where are you from? I'm from Northern Arizona. So, okay. like, do you know? Where do you know where Flagstaff is? Yes, yeah, I've been there before. Okay. Did you like it? No, there's not really much there. It's really not. It's kind of a college town. That's yeah. where I went to college, and I, I just. What's the university I see again? <laughs> um, I went to NAU. I see my friend Tasha commenting. What? She said, "What is Tasha saying?" She said, "You told him now what." 
he's still online. I don't know. Maybe she's maybe she's talking to the people in the comments. Cause I see, I see all the people. I see all the people on it. Yo, let me tell you something. I, I what I can't tell you about myself. Okay. Atlanta probably is the gayest fucking city to be in in America. <laughs> I've heard. Yeah, and if you ever watch the Atlanta Housewife, they represent <laughs> well. Yeah, see, okay? my, my friend right. Tasha is in the comments yeah. defending me right now because these people are talking um, shit. She knows she's going to be defended like crazy. <laughs> but b- being nice Atlanta thing. is one of the gayest cities in America, being that I grew up in New York City, Okay, mm-hmm. which is a big city, and I've been around. Um, uh, I've been around gay men all my life. Okay, that's not my preference. Okay, that's yours, not mine. But I have no hate in my heart towards anyone. I, I love I it. Not, I do not. Okay. All right, and a lot of my friends are gay. Okay. Mine too. All right, <laughs> and it's okay. All right, this guys is guys and this, girls. Just as long, yeah, guys and girls, just as long as we respect the boundaries, you know what I'm saying? Our preferences is cool. You know what I'm saying? I love you, Tashi. I see her commenting. I'm sorry. mm -hmm. I just. That's cool. (laughs) And what is your name? My name is Chase, like the bank. Chase, yes, yes. I like Chase. I know (laughs) a girl named Chase. She lives in Chicago. I know one girl named Chase as well. It's it's not very common that I mm-hmm. meet other Chases. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, Chase, I hope you're not chasing men all day long. No, I have work to do today. I just oh, you, kind of, do, you, do you have a partner? Do I have a partner? Yeah. No, a, I'm saying I, I have a roommate, but um, no, I don't have a partner. Okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, you're working on that, Chase. I'm trying. Okay. Not uh-huh. trying too hard, but I mean. <laughs> okay, you gotta you, you gotta have self love first. Exactly. You okay. have to love yourself before you can expect to love someone else. Exactly. All right. <laughs> but it was great talking to you, Chase. Yes. All right. Definitely feel free to follow me. I would love to reconnect. Okay. I guess. Send me, send me a DM. I definitely will. I like your energy. Okay. okay. Thank you for talking. You're so nice. You're welcome. (laughs) Thank you, Peter. I will talk to you later, okay? Okay. Okay. (laughs) Chase was nice. Mm -hmm. I did not know Chase was a guy. I thought I was talking to a woman. I'm going to have to go clean my glasses. I'm going to work. I am the fucking worst, <laughs> but I'm the best at the same time. Uh, okay, uh, I was gonna say something, but um, that would be just buying into the bullshit. Uh, on some real shit, I'm not prejudiced towards no one. Okay, um, no one from no community. Okay, to each his own. Okay, I believe in what I believe in. They believe in what they believe in. It's all good. All right, just as long as they respect my line, I will respect their line, okay? It's all good, all right? We're, at the end of the day, we all God's, we all God's children, okay? And uh, I had a debate yesterday with somebody about what is and what isn't God. And what I could tell them and what I said to them is that when I look outside my window and I see the trees and I see the, the, the breeze, 